Uh, 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 Wake up! <laughs> we had to gag him to stop the screaming. You shouldn't have brought them here, Andre. Why not? <laughs> You've been a bad boy, Mr. Balkan. And the boss is not happy. Oh, no. I <laughs> shit my pants. Not yet, but you will. Who are you working for? Uh, my cousin, Roman. <laughs> Don't be an idiot. That's not good enough. I'm gonna saw off your fucking arm. Speak! Okay, okay. Your dad likes it up the ass. What do you want me to say, huh? <laughs> oh! 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 Very funny. Do you think you're so smart? <laughs> no! I'm tied up in the basement a long way from home, while some ape threatens me with a hacksaw. So no, I'm not that smart. Shut the fuck up! My fucking wife is watching television! <laughs> Good lord, what are you doing? Nothing. Uh, I mean, uh, I was finding out who he is. And? Who is he? He is his cousin. You were about to cut up some guy in my house, making all that noise to find out he is his cousin. Where did you find this idiot? He was a friend of your sergeant when we were in Vladivostok. He's an imbecile. So, Nico Belli. You think it's okay to kill my employees? If he is an asshole, yes. Go ahead. Oh. I agree. Mikhail! <laughs> asshole, look at me like I'm a piece of shit. Bozo my. Now listen, Nico Bellic. You are very lucky Blood was an idiot. The only reason I keep him around is because I fucked his sister. Look at me. You owe me. I got some digheads in my neighborhood. Trying to run a shipment, yeah? And we found a buyer for the TVs. Yes, a buyer. But you've got to get them for us so we can make the sale. Can you untie Roman? Хорошо. Help! Shut up, Roman. Shut up! Roman, shut up! Shut up, Roman! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Stop shooting people, you maniac! My wife doesn't like when people shout! Whatever! You better get those screens soon! Or I will personally pull your cousin's stitches out! One by one, and watch his gut spill onto the floor! Clean this shit up! Listen, we'll take care of your cousin, but you better get the police car. And then you call me! Roman! Roman! Go! 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 I, I'll take care of him! Fuck! There he is, Nico Belek. Nico, these are my two brothers. Well, two of my brothers, the two that count. Derek and Gerald. Hi. Derek has just returned to the family fold after a good few years in the old country, involved in the struggle. Sort of like you, I'd imagine. And Jerry, Jerry's the man. And you remember Michael, St. Michael? <laughs> yes, yes, it's uh, nice to meet you. <laughs> Nico's a trip, man. I met him through that Puerto Rican coke dealer. So you want to involve him in family business? What do you know about him? What I know is he likes a fight and he ain't the fucking law. Oh. No offense, mister? That ain't good enough. Well, it's good enough for me. He's a good lad, Jerry. Uh, was I talking to you in bread halfwit? <laughs> I make a point of not talking to the unfortunate victims of brother-sister marriage. Don't you speak about my parents like that. Oh, you're like fucking Cleopatra. Fifteen generations of brother-sisters fucking, and you're so thick you take orders off my idiot brother Packy. Who's so stupid, he had to tattoo his name on his arm. If there is a problem, I'll go. No trouble. I have other ways of making money. There's no problem. Jerry yeah. just likes to think he knows best about everything, which is why he's been married three times already and still won't admit he likes men. <laughs> <laughs> ah, no problem. I'll leave you boys to it. Don't screw up. Packy, take care of Derek. He's been away. And you? Nothing personal, but don't fuck with my family. Or I will fuck with yours.
It's all about problems and solutions. Ah, Nico! Of course, you guys already know each other. Nico, good to see you. Interesting friendships you both keep. Yeah, very interesting. The mayor will be here in a minute, and I have two senators dropping by later. Everyone wants to pay homage to a dying legend. Everyone wants the glamour of a bygone age. Everyone. Now that you hear what I said. Yeah, I heard what you said. Nico, our friend here, is telling me that the Ancelotti's are in league with the Russians. Ancelotti's? I know these guys 73 years. In 1972, I should have killed his uncle. But I spared him. And this is how he repays me? Unbelievable! And now he's stealing drugs with Ivan the goddamn terrible! <laughs> So what we're saying is, this is a matter of security, <laughs> national. Normally, I don't care about cocaine. Keeps controllable people in power. But this is no good. All right, what's my role in this? The distribution network is a fleet of vans parked at a grocery warehouse in Alderney City. The product is packed into the frames of the vans, ready to be moved all over the country. Destroy everything, whatever it takes. And for me? For you. I've got a real gift for you. Get this done, then we'll talk. 